If your baby does not like tummy time, they might need a few modifications to help them ease into it. The number one thing I say about tummy time or any time you're picking up your baby is to avoid the plop and pluck. So a lot of us will plop and pluck or plop and pluck. And this is a lot of stimulation for your baby. So the first thing I recommend is to give your baby the experience of being upright with a gentle hold around the ribs and then giving them the chance to have a little contact on their feet. You can make eye contact with them to see if they're in a quiet alert state and interested in playing and engaging in something challenging. And then gently, slowly roll them down pelvis and then spine. From here, you can just go halfway with the baby. It doesn't have to be this full tummy time experience. Being on their side is a very important part of their development as well. So if your baby already starts to complain that this is too much and they're becoming overwhelmed, you just roll them back out. And if they settle on their back, great. If they need a little bit more help to calm, then you just bring them up and help co-regulate. Now, if you're able to get them from the side onto their tummy, I would encourage you to bring their arms up underneath their shoulders to kind of get them set up for success. And then see if your baby's able to lift and extend their head and their upper back. If their head is too heavy, which it is the heaviest part of them at this time, you can give them a little bit of support underneath the chest or underneath the shoulders just to take some of that weight off and enable them to experience this up, it, up position so that it is um, rewarding with some eye contact or they could have some toys or a sibling or a family pet nearby so that they experience like, ah, there's a whole world if I just motivate to look up. And then when your baby starts to give you some cues that they need a break, you would support their arm by bringing it under and then rolling them weight bearing across the shoulder, letting them land on their back and then you can lift them up to calm and co-regulate.